You're in the percussive hall of fame. Is it a yeah. constant, constant learning curve playing an instrument professionally? Are you always striving to be better? I don't think that it ever comes into it to play it better. It's, uh, you know, some days I think, oh my God, I've played every fill I know. But uh, in the end, you haven't because something new comes through. Now, Liverpool 8 is your 14th album. Does songwriting get any easier? Is it something that comes naturally, if you like? Uh, depends on the day. I mean, you know, it's interesting now because, you know, I work out a lot, so I get a lot of inspiration being on the treadmill. <laughs> the endorphins go up and songs appear. It's, uh, it's far out. But it comes from anywhere. It comes from a line, you know, something you think of. And I'm still doing what I do, and that's the deal. Now, you'd said that on your birthday, at midday, around the world. You Noon, to midday. To, you know, do the peace and love. Peace and love. If there's something you could change about the world today, is there, is there something that you would fix? Well, I still have this dream that uh, one day, one minute, one year, the whole world will go peace and love. And it will give everyone a chance just to stop for a minute and think of the violence and, you know, the heartache around the world and the pain. Um, and maybe a change will go on, who knows? What would you do if I sang at a 